Nice to meet you everyone. Today we are talking about Cambodia education. Here is an agenda. First, we are going to discuss about current educational system in Cambodia. Sheila, can you tell us about it? There is morning class and afternoon class at elementary and middle school. <clears throat> it is four hours class. In high school, it is different from every school, private school and public school. Public school study for four hours and private school study for seven hours. Cheating is common and teachers are treated not so good than other countries. Now, Jihee is going to explain you about how much does it cost for an average student to attend school each month. For public school, um, from elementary to high school is free, and private school is depend on school. Now, Lisa is going to tell you about how many children never go to school because it costs us costs too much. Mm. Because students have to buy some school su su supplies and they have to buy gas to go into school. They have lots of supplies to buy. And some of the students doesn't go to school because they have to earn money for their life. What does knowledge about community? The effect of little or no schooling on Cambodia family is their nations can't really improve because they won't be able to cultivate people of talent. Okay, thank you for telling a lot of opinion. Lastly, I want to tell you about why it is important to think about educational opportunity of child in Cambodia as an 8th grade current student. We have greater educational system than other countries like Cambodia. If we don't care about them, they can't get opportunities and more. Even if we are not same places with them, I think we need to help as a human. Also, as a global leader, we have duty to share our educational system.